if you are starting out with, with exercise, you've just found out that you've got osteoarthritis or you'd like to, to prevent a condition, you can certainly contact a physiotherapist or exercise physiologist who can help you at best advise what exercise is, is going to be suitable for you and your condition. You may have additional injuries from your past, which we don't want to exacerbate through a physical activity or exercise program. It's also a great idea to find a buddy, someone else that has a similar condition to you that can, can go along to support you or a family member if you're a little bit nervous or apprehensive about your, your first program. So always good to um, you know buddy up with someone and find someone that's going to support you through that transition. Uh, get some education about your, your condition and how it might be best to get involved in physical activity or exercise. Generally, if you if you have osteoarthritis, you will experience pain from time to time or chronic pain. So when starting any new physical activity or exercise program, how to know when to stop, you know, how much does it hurt? Should I keep going? Should I push through this pain barrier? I would suggest starting out with a very light activity program for 10 minutes, whether that be uh, in the water, a strength training program, or a cardiovascular aerobic program. See how your body responds one to two days after the physical activity. If you're feeling okay, then you know that perhaps you could increase that to 15 minutes and so on week to week to get a gauge. So being in pain, uh, if you do find that post-exercise you need to see a GP about some, some pain management strategies or you can go back to your exercise physiologist or physiotherapist to look at options that are, that are going to be suitable for you to suit uh, your needs and also um, help you with, with managing that pain. Mm -hmm.